Here's the science behind letting go of old behaviors that no longer serve you. Most people try to change by adding on more habits, especially in the context of New Year's resolutions. But newer science shows that change starts by unlearning old patterns and behaviors. Think of habits and patterns as reflexes between neurons. So in neuroscience, what fires together, wires together. So if you have two neurons that get activated at the same time and exchange information, they strengthen the, the synapses and their connection over time. And the more you repeat something, the more it gets strengthened. And in order to weaken those connections between the neurons, you have to put your brain in a state called long-term depression. What long-term depression means is that you deprive the connection between the two neurons, which are responsible in activating the behavior or the thought that you want to weaken. In order to put this theory into practice, I invite you to follow the three A's. Number one, assess. So get very clear on the behavior or the thought pattern that you want to get rid of. Number two is articulate. Get very clear on why you want to get rid of that old behavior or that old thought pattern. And then number three is attribute. Here, I invite you to attribute the positive effects that you will gain from letting go of the old thought patterns or behaviors. Now that you have weakened the old thought patterns, you want to override them with new thought patterns. And the way to do that is that you want to be very specific on the new behavior or the new thought pattern that you want to implement. You can write it down, you can tell a friend about it, so you have an accountability partner. And then the second step, and it's very important, is to practice, practice, practice. Every time you catch yourself falling back into old patterns, you need to override them with the new patterns to reinforce the new neural pathways in your brain until they become automatic.